two, three. Hi. Welcome back to the channel. Hi, welcome back to the channel. Me plus you is? Us. <laughs> I'm kidding. Yeah, my name is Kwame. This is Elaine. And we're happy to be back on your screens. Yes. So as you can see in the title and in our thumbnail, well, we have some sharing to do. Yes, because as you know, um, we have a newborn. Yeah. And we're also on YouTube, as yeah. you can see. Yeah. And we had a, quite a process of thought and discussion and sharing on do we show the baby or not? Yeah. And we've also seen it in the comments in the C-section, a different C-section. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Who even says that? In the C-section. People say that. In the comment section? People yes, say in the C-section. C-section. Where yeah. did you hear that? Well, I don't, I don't know. I have to verify, but <laughs> people say that. Do it in the C-section. Um, that you would like to see the baby. And we understand that because I'm like, it's so cute. Um, but we decided uh, not to show the baby. Yeah, we decided not to show his face, at least on... The, um, on the internet, on social media. Yeah. We'll show the baby, as in you see that this is the baby, you see maybe from the profile or the back, yeah. you know, this is like he exists and he's with us and it's me plus you is us and the family's expanding. But yeah, um, we're, gonna, gonna, we're not going to create content specifically showing him his face and yeah. that content around him is what we're trying to say. We're not going to do that. Yeah, we have like, as with everything we do, <laughs> we put a lot of thoughts in it. Yeah. So we came up with three reasons why uh, we are not showing him. Yeah. And the first one is a big one for us, which is consent. Yeah. Um, he's too small to agree to anything, really. <laughs> uh, and of course, we chose to record episodes and be on YouTube and be vulnerable and share things with Yeah, it's uh, our choice. We're old enough to understand what it means, putting ourselves out there. Yes. But for him, he doesn't he cannot choose it now and I mean he chose us as parents, but <laughs> he didn't choose to be on YouTube uh, and he cannot uh, speak for himself. Uh so we don't feel comfortable if he cannot choose it himself. Yeah. Mm, that it should be on our channel. Um, aside from that, I also think we can discuss parenthood without necessarily showing our kid. Yeah. Um, for us, we've always shared uh, things that are talked about things that are not necessarily visible, right? You just look at us, you hear our conversations. So I think we can still share who we are as parents and this new role and everything else that's coming at us uh, full force without um necessarily sharing him so it doesn't really um devaluate what we discuss yeah um yeah so that that's that's also important yeah and then the second reason is privacy yeah the second reason is privacy um and the privacy bit here is for the future <coughs> it, it kind of ties into the consent as well but, uh, I mean, as we're putting stuff out there, we're leaving our digital footprints online. And there's so much about you that you think that people don't know. But by virtue of the fact that you're even having conversations, you know, all these targeted ads and whatever you think you see, you have a conversation with somebody, and then all of a sudden you start seeing such things on your timeline. And, you know, I'm just saying that he hasn't asked for any of that yet. And yeah. we can't be the one to decide wants to decide his digital footprint before he's aware of such a thing. So for him to, again, decide on his own. So it's tying with the consent. Yeah. And yeah, and I, I do think we already also put out quite a lot of ourselves in our conversations. So we're, we're already sharing a lot. Yeah. Um, and I think for us, it's important to really be mindful of what we're sharing and what we're not sharing. And for me personally, I had to get used to even the interactions based on that people know us from YouTube. Yeah. Um, we because meet, we meet you will, you like, it's not like you meet somebody you've never, well, I meet somebody I've never met before, but often people watch our videos 
they feel like they know us because <laughs> we talk about so many things, which is great. I, th I think it's great that yeah, it's people what, come it's, up it's, to it's, us. It's what the community is. It's, it's a byproduct of yeah. us putting ourselves out there. Yeah, so we people, form a community, yeah. so technically they do know us. They do know us, but not like they've never, we've never met. But you start on that, the interaction is, is funny because... I don't know you, so I start like here on like the Try we don't to know, know each you, other. And you know a lot and about me. And you know a lot about me. And that's also where people start from, from like, I know you, I know this and this and this. So even for me, that took a bit of time to like, how do you navigate those kind of conversations? And luckily, Kwame has a bit of not, yeah. um, media experience, of course, from his work at radio. So he could help me with that. But I would not want my child to go through these kind of interactions yet or that people come up to us and immediately like uh, shout his name or like say like oh you went here last week right i think i wouldn't feel comfortable with that him, yeah. um it might change in time but for now i i i already found that a lot to navigate let alone i want to put that on him um, yeah. i'm not so comfy with that so that was the the privacy thing as well yeah and then the last reason and the last reason is the safety bits yeah <clears throat> because with yeah, go I ahead. Mean, yeah of course with um, the openness to the whole the wide is it world wide <laughs> web yes world wide web yes. yeah so the op openness to that whole thing also means that, I mean, the information about you out there or what people know. I mean, we don't even feel or we don't expect that the people who watch us um, have any ill intentions. And that's what also makes it easier for us to share um, this part of ourselves. But not everybody who watches us is thinking that way or not everybody who watches us is even for us and our community. People watch for their own personal reasons. Yeah. And some of those reasons might really not be like safe for the child. I mean, for us as adults, at least we, we are adults, so uh, we, we can, can manage it. Yeah, or defend ourselves to some degree. But for him, there's nothing like that. There's nothing barring except us. And if yeah. he's ever in a situation where we are not present, it, that makes him very, very vulnerable. And um, we'd rather the people who <clears throat> have access to him are people that we trust and know yeah for his own safety yeah and of course there are also a lot of creepy people on the internet and mm -hmm. people that i don't know i would not want to expose him to that at this point um so we choose kind of with who we share him and yeah we're a bit mindful of that as well um and we would also never post any real life locations for that reason for example when we do vlogs mostly there's some time in between so i don't know i think it would be you don't know what people if they really want to meet you they might i don't know check your real life social media i am not so comfortable with that in the first place i mean you post after you've left the place yeah but not everybody does that yeah i mean yeah so that's also a safety thing like like, we love when people come up to us, we have a conversation, all these things, but you don't want people to be able to track you or... Yeah, that's not uh, it's, fun. No, it's, yeah. that's too much. You feel like you're being um, watched all the time. Yeah, so we're like, no, that's also not really what we want. And maybe as a disclaimer, like, it doesn't mean that people who do put their kids out there that we're like, whoa, why are you doing that? We're not judging that, but we... We just don't feel comfortable as parents. Yeah. And I think there are many families who do it in a very respectful way and they really... And they understand the repercussions of it as well. And yeah, they do, they protect do it. And protect their, their families. Yeah, but yeah. for us, it doesn't feel right to, to put him here on, on, on the tube. <laughs> yeah. And I think there are also many ways to show him without showing necessarily his face. What Kwame said, like... Um, from the back, the back or you will see him in our activity vlogs i'm sure you'll see him running around at some point or but it, it's just not like as visible as we would be because this is mainly our channel we are having the conversations and he's part of the us um but we don't want to put him out there uh, yet he can, yeah he can decide for himself that he can 
decide for himself, also protect himself against any yeah. possible. And I mean, there are a lot of opinions about this, especially because a lot of uh, family channels or channels with babies on it do very well. Um, again, good for you. <laughs> I think, yeah, we, we've never started this thing to... Want to go very commercial for. and say like we want to go for the big money and it's not our our channel is a part of who we are and it's more like a diary of sharing yeah know, and authentic conversations and yeah often authentic and commercial often not all the time they don't really go together so for us that wasn't a motivator or not the sole motivator to do this so mm, in that also was not an argument for us to do put him out there because yeah. yeah, we can do well by ourselves and still still manage <laughs> manage. Yeah, so that's that's about it. It's very short and uh, straightforward. So you will so, be seeing yeah. bits and pieces of him as best as we can. Yes, and we can still discuss. We'll still discuss parenthood. We we'll still discuss things we explore with him, things we do yeah. with him. Um, the same way Nala is sometimes in our vlogs. She also cannot consent, but her, digi <laughs> her digital footprint is a bit smaller. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll just go with that for now. Yeah. And, we just and if it does to change in the future? It might change. <coughs> I mean, Who knows? maybe it's really like a movie star. You don't know. <laughs> yeah. So that's about it. We're done with this particular share. <laughs> and we'll catch you in the next video. Catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.